very much, Mr. Secretary, Mr. Minister. Mr. Secretary, this is the first time, according to the Pentagon, that China has sent a surveillance balloon over the U.S. for such duration. And as you have just said, it's the first time on the eve of a planned visit by an American Secretary of State to China. Is canceling your trip or postponing your trip enough of a consequence? What are the other consequences that China should have to take for these actions? And secondly, if I may, uh, what are the opportunity costs of not meeting with the Chinese and with the Chinese president at a time of such tensions with Taiwan and continuing U.S. concerns over China's support for Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine? Thanks. Thanks, Andrea. Um, let's start with this. It's very important to emphasize that the presence of this surveillance balloon over uh, the United States um, in our skies is a clear violation of our sovereignty, a clear violation of international law, and clearly unacceptable. And we've made that clear uh, to, uh, to China. Um, any country that has its airspace violated in this way, I think, would uh, respond similarly. And uh, I can only imagine what the reaction would be in China if they were on uh, the other end. And what this has done uh, is created the conditions um, that undermine the purpose of the trip, including ongoing efforts to build a floor under the relationship uh, and to address a broad range of issues that are of concern uh, to the American people, uh, I believe to the Chinese people, and certainly as well to people uh, around the world. Um, so uh, we took the step that uh, I um, announced earlier today in postponing the planned visit for this weekend. Meanwhile, uh, we are going to remain uh, engaged with the PRC as this ongoing issue uh, is resolved. Uh, the first step is getting the surveillance asset out of our airspace, uh, and that's what we're focused on. Um, and I thought it was very important for Wang Yi, the senior foreign policy official uh, in Beijing, to hear this directly from me. Um, it would be premature for me to weigh in on any other specifics uh, as this surveillance balloon remains in our airspace. As I said, job one is getting it out of our airspace. Um, we continue to believe that having open lines of communication uh, is important. Indeed, this uh, incident only underscores uh, the importance, and that's why we will uh, maintain them. Uh, and that's also why, when conditions permit, uh, I uh, plan to go to, uh, to China. But uh, the most important thing right now in the moment is uh, to see that this surveillance asset gets out of our airspace, and, and we'll take it from there. Sit Sung, Sung Mo Nam of SBS. Andrea, Andrea, we Again, need to move on. Again, I, uh, I don't want to get ahead of uh, anything other than to say that the first step is to get the surveillance uh, craft out of our airspace. Sung Mo Nam of SBS.